So what's your actual name and do you have a cosplay page? Um, my actual name is Trent Baybridge and no I don't have a cosplay page, this is just me just dressing up. As just for fun? Yeah, just for fun, yeah. 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 Be Peter Parker, why not? Exactly, yeah. <laughs> so, I heard and saw the trailer for the new uh, for the new Avengers film. The Ca Captain America Civil War? Yes, Captain... Yes. That's yeah. the one. <laughs> very, very excited for it, very excited. You know, uh, Spider-Man is in there himself. He's in the trailer at the very end with the Captain America shield. Yes, what do you think uh, of his eyes? Because a lot of people are saying they don't like the way his eyes... No, uh, I reckon it's very... Uh, it's very Steve, classic. Yes, yeah, classic Steve Ditko comic book style, especially how they move. It's very uh, going back to the comics, which I like. I like the, how they've done that finally in, in a movie. So, yes, really I, good to see how it turns out. Yes, I quite liked it as well. Yeah. So, and there's this new thing going around on the internet that you like rice. Do I like what? Spe specifically Uncle Ben's rice. Oh, yes, Uncle Ben's rice. Yes, the, the photo. Yeah, yeah. Yes. It's like crying. No, yeah. No, yeah, Uncle, no ben. Does, yeah. <laughs> Uncle Ben. Uncle yeah. Ben. That that is funny though. I've, I've seen this movie. Yes, yeah. I've seen it quite a few <laughs> times. So, what made you want to dress up as Spider-Man? Oh, I love Spider-Man since I was a kid, really, and um, I eventually wanted to get a costume like that's really authentic, and so here I am now. So. <laughs> awesome. Well, thank you so much for uh, interviewing. Thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. Nice to meet you. I have found a Spider-Woman. Let's see what's underneath all, underneath that mask. The reveal. <laughs> so off camera, we're talking about the what's the female equivalent of Peter? Would yeah, it be Patricia or Pamela? There was Penny and Penny. Penelope mentioned, I reckon. But... YouTube, if you can figure out a female equivalent name of Peter, please write it in the comments. We need help. <laughs> so what made you decide to be Peter? Um, Spider-Man, yeah, Spider-Woman. It was actually sort of like a last minute decision. Like my sewing machine originally broke for the last costume and I was like, I have a camera with me all day, so, and I can't really manage Peter Parker. So. Well, Peter Parker is a photographer from yeah. the Daily Bugle, so why not? Okay, spoiler alert. Oh, like, shh. You didn't hear it from me. <laughs> <laughs> so, are you, do you normally come to conventions or is this your first time? Um, this isn't my first time, but it's my first time in Melbourne. Okay, I came to a you couple, uh, Gold Coast and Brisbane, so I'm usually up at those ones. Okay, did you move here or? Oh, uh, yeah, this... I moved here. Oh, and nice. I didn't get to make it last year. So. Okay, well, welcome to Melbourne. Thank you. <laughs> I hope you're enjoying it. It's pretty alright. The conventions are a lot bigger. I haven't been to Gold Coast, so. Oh, yeah. have to take the word. <laughs> yes, definitely on my list. <laughs> alright, well, thank you so much. Oh, good. It was lovely. Guys, there's apparently three more Avatar movies coming, so we should get used to seeing this. Uh, that, this is an impressive Navi. This, this, this damn impressive, yeah? Yes, it is. Uh, and a lot of work. Do you want to identify yourself as your name or your character? Uh, I'll go with my character, Natiri. Okay, all right. So how long did it take to make the costume? Uh, about four months. Four months. That, that's a hell of a lot of work, for, I mean, for four months. I mean, I'm assuming that... Did you get the wig or did you style it or what? Um, the wig I bought, it was the only thing ready made that I bought and I added beads to it and cut it a little bit and that was about it. I was, and you, the headdress and it, the everything else, mm -hmm. what's all that made out of? Um, the headdress is made out of warbler. I knew you were going to say warbler. <laughs> <laughs> of course, yes. And the little rock on the front is made out of sculpey. Now I was going to say, this, guys, when I first looked, I didn't even spot you. You have a fake nose. I looked at, I didn't notice. I mean, well, I imagine. It was, I mean, there's a little bit of a line there. I suspect it might have looked a little. It's probably a bit worse for wear by the by now, or. Um, it has been cracking a little bit, especially when the headdress falls down on it, and which isn't good. But you know, you have your cosplay faults and everything, so. Yeah, uh, that's I, what happens. Uh, are you mentally already lining up to go see the next Avatar movies? Uh, yes, I am secretly. <laughs> yeah.
Yeah, I'm not sure. I think it comes out maybe next year. I, it's uh, it's been hard to tell, but I mean, most of it's digital, and I don't yeah. think he's going to let us know. He's not going to say, "Yeah, we started filming. Get out your money." Yeah. Oh well, I'm a big fan of Zoe Saldana and her work. So, and she's an amazing character in the theory. Yep. And she does it so well. I mean, yeah, she's fantastic. Where would you like to see her character go? Um, I haven't really thought about that. Um, That's why I'm asking you now. <laughs> I'm sure Natiri finds her ways and, you know, all about saving her planet and, you know, things like that. She can do what she likes. I'm just thinking, if he's got three more movies coming, he's got, he, like, is she going to have, is it going to be like, here's Natiri and then her kids will eventually come in? She, um, yeah, she seems to have... A partner now. Yeah, um, that, you know. Jake Sully, so we'll see what happens there. <laughs> I've just had a terrible life. What happens when you genetically crossbreed a, 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 a vat grown Navi with a pure bred Navi and oh dear? Yeah. Would that even work? I don't know. Maybe they'll have to go through IVF. Go through this somehow <laughs> in that. A little don't, uh, don't touch it, you'll go blind. <laughs> oh, yeah. I forgot about that. Well, like, it's a great costume, and you're going to get years of work or work use out of it with the three movies coming, I'm sure. Yes. Premieres and all that sort of thing, maybe. Okay. Well, yeah. Hey, if he films some of it in Australia, it could be an Australian premiere, maybe. in which case, if you're looking for somebody to be on the blue, I think they did a blue carpet, um, you know, hit her up. Now, um, how long did it take to put this together? Uh, I would say about four months. Four, um, four months? Yes. Thank you so much! <laughs> we'll go back a minute. Hi, Sean. Sean, would you... I'll stay here. Come here. Come here. Come here, Sean. Sean's meant to be helping us out stopping stuff like that happening. I didn't know you were right. I know. I'm, I'm overheated and dying. So, <laughs> it's all B-roll stuff. <laughs>